Good evening. Welcome to Sundays at 6, a casual bluegrass worship service from Wrightsville United Methodist Church. My name is Christina Turner and I am associate pastor and I'm probably going to be joined this evening by my feline friend Finn, um, who is who is the honorary mascot of Wrightsville during these times. We are so glad that you are here worshiping with us. We um, invite you, whether you have been a Sundays at Six regular since we began a few years ago, or whether this is your first time. If you are a member of Wrightsville or a regular visitor, a member of our friends at Oleander United Methodist Church, or if you say, I haven't been to church in years, Regardless, we want this to be a space where you can come just as you are to worship the God who meets you and loves you just as you are. Our goal here is connection and not perfection. We normally meet at six o'clock on Sunday nights in Wrightsville Beach and share some bluegrass music, share communion, and share a time of reflection together as a space where you can come in your flip-flops or your Sunday best. Um, but we believe that we are called to be better together. And so uh, right now on the season of coronavirus, in the season of Eastertide, we are going to be meeting online and sharing some music from different church members' homes, um, some of whom are our band, Annie Oak, made of Annie Jewell, David Canning, and Justin Lacey, and as well as my home right here in downtown Wilmington. We would love for you to light a candle, to make a sacred space, and maybe also during this time to give. Um, if you're a member of Oleander United Methodist Church, uh, you can find your church's giving information on their website. And if you're a member of Wrightsville um, or would like to donate to our ministries, you can go to wrightsvilleumc.org and click the Give tab. You can give on the Wrightsville UMC app, or you can send out a check to P.O. Box 748, Wrightsville Beach, North Carolina, 28480. We have a couple announcements. Uh, first of all, we are going to be having an online talent show. It's called, Hey Wrightsville, Look at Me. And so we know that a lot of y'all have things that you've been practicing for, whether or not it's recitals or uh, dance classes, horseback riding shows, any sort of thing. You can juggle if you want. We'd love uh, for you to post these in the Hey Right So Look At Me event. You can go over to our Facebook page, take a short video and post those. We can't wait to see your talents. Um, second of all, yesterday was Super Service Saturday. Through our outreach committee, we have organized some opportunities to reach out in outreach during the month of April through our Vision 2020 program. And we would love for you to reach out too. You can go to rightsvilleumc.org slash serve hyphen locally and see a list of ideas that you can use to be involved. Uh, those may be writing a card of encouragement from home. It may be going to, if you are not high at risk, uh, going to be a volunteer at Mother Hubbard's Cupboard. It could be sewing some life-saving face masks for our neighbors. It might be having a neighborhood food drive for Mother Hubbard's Cupboard. We would love for you to reach out even while you're staying in. And last but not least, our, our giving agency through our outreach committee this week is LINK. LINK, L-I-N-C stands for Leading Into New Communities. And LINK is an organization started by Frankie Roberts that works here in Wilmington to help uh, men and women who are coming out of prison to become incorporated into society and to create new, uh, new fully whole, um, contributing to the community sorts of lives. So we would love for you to give to Link in addition to your other gifts. If you're able, um, you can click over to rightsvilleumc.org and give there and put Link, L-A-N-C, in the memo line, or you can put that in the memo line of your check. And now I just love to invite you to pray with me as we worship God together. Oh Lord, you are risen. You are risen indeed. We thank you that nothing Nothing, not hatred, not violence, not despair, not death. Nothing could separate us from your love. When the world said no, when all the forces in the universe said no, you said yes. Yes to life. Yes to love. Yes to freedom. Lord, we pray that your resurrection life would speak in us, would breathe new life into us, even in this uncertain time. Speak to us, Lord. 
for your servants are listening. We ask all these things in the name of Christ. Amen. And now I invite you to settle in and to, to prepare your hearts for worship as you listen to this offering of special music. grateful to have our many musicians, even in this time of social distancing, to be bringing us music from their homes. Um, and so we would love for you to be part of our Sundays at 6 worship experience. We are going to be cutting together worship services, and so we would love for you to be a reader, to read scripture, whether you are age 6 or age 96. Uh, we would love for you to provide some praise music we would love for you even maybe to give a testimony about uh, or tell the story about somebody you know who has answered the question, what's next with creativity and hope. So if you have any of that, please reach out to me at christinat at rightsvillumc.org or um, call the church office and say you'd love to be a part of helping, uh, helping us worship with Sundays at six. Um, and now as, as we move into a time of prayer, I'd love for you to post in the comments, what is it that we can be praying for right now? I These may be prayers of thanksgiving. These may be prayers of, of lament. We continue to lift up Annie and Isabel Jewell. Um, Annie is, of course, beloved part of our Sundays at Six family, and Isabel has provided music for us as well. They are still recovering from coronavirus, but um, Annie is several days symptom free and gets to see her family soon and is feeling well enough to give us some music at the end of this service. And so we continue to pray for Annie and we continue to pray for everyone who needs um, Christ's loving care. And so I invite us in the comments to share our own prayers as Jackson Norville um, sings a song that's quite appropriate for our scripture today, Just a Closer Walk With Thee. I am weak, but thou art strong. Jesus, keep me from all. Thank you. 
Thank you so much to Jackson Norville for our uh, musical offering as we, as we prayed and as we lifted each other up in prayer requests in the comments and also um, discussed how God might be opening your eyes. What is just outside the frame? What is just outside your way of thinking? What could be next? in light of this pandemic. I don't mean to make light of a horrible situation and I don't believe that God brings about pandemics to make us be creative. And yet um, from our service, Super Service Saturday's photos yesterday to seeing all of the pastors and uh, church leaders, all of the doctors and nurses um, who are rising up to this challenge, everyone who is making music from their living rooms, who are holding board meetings with their babies, everyone whose dogs and cats are being weathermen right alongside with them. I can't help but think that maybe um, what we need is here through the power of the Holy Spirit. Wendell Berry wrote a poem called What We Need Is Here. And I would love us to, to finish our service with this. Before we hear Annie Jewell sing Rise Up, coming from her apartment downtown. Wendell Berry is a, um, a agrarian, you could say, in Kentucky. <laughs> he is a, a farmer poet, and um, he wrote a poem called What We Need Is Here. He says, horseback on Sunday morning, harvest over we taste persimmon and wild grape, sharp sweet of summer's end. In time's maze over fall fields, we name names that rest on graves. We open a persimmon seed to find the tree that stands in promise, pale in the seed's marrow. Geese appear high above us, pass in the sky closes, abandon as in love or sleep holds them to their way. Clear in the ancient faith, what we need is here. And we pray, not for new earth or heaven, but to be quiet in heart and in eye clear. What we need is here. Friends, Jesus rose and because he rose, we have everything we need. Um, even in this time of scarcity, even as we are struggling to um, find a vaccine, to manufacture PPE, to find ways to reach out, to seek out our friends and our loved ones, to figure out even how we can be church together. What would it mean if what we needed was here, already among us, already with us, because the risen Christ is here with us, maybe just outside the frame? I wonder what it means for us as a people, as God's people, as a Sundays at Six family, as a Wrightsville and Oleander family, what it means for us as just regular people to rise up, to rise up in love, to rise up in strength and hope, to rise because Christ is risen. Christ is risen indeed. Amen. You're broken down and Living life on a merry-go-round And you can't find the fighter But I see it in you so we don't work it out And move mountains We gon' work it out
Blue